Cinderella's a magical production all around. I have done a lot of Ashton ballets and his style is so distinguished. It's the footwork, it's the musicality, very feminine. It's just a dream to dance. I had my debut as Cinderella in 2010. So I have done this ballet obviously many times and that brings layers and makes you see things in a different way and you want more from yourself so you push to do things better. One of the reasons I think also it will feel different this time around is because I know the music much better, I feel more comfortable with the choreography, but I think also is because now I have the experience, like I don't need to try to be a ballerina, like I think I kind of now can say that I am a ballerina. <laughs> if you know, I, I'm not trying to sound snobby, but it's like I think when you're young you're trying, you know, and sometimes you feel like the costume and the tiara that he overtakes you, but now hopefully it can all be what it is. <laughs> Classical ballet, when you want to do it well and when it's well done, it's hard. It doesn't matter what, it's always extremely hard. Sometimes I am standing in the studio and Vadim is doing his solo and I'll go like, oh my God, I get to see this for free every day. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. His dancing is textbook. It's like what you want classical dancing to be like. The precision, the easiness, the beauty. That gives me inspiration. When you do sharper, yeah. so no, And when you do no, the arabesque, sharp into that. It was a little bit soft. It's Fine. We have danced together for many, many years. Uh, in many different productions, and I feel that we have found this really beautiful partnership. We look at each other and we know. Sometimes I can, I can get a little bit nervous, or I'll take myself very seriously, and then I, you know, he will say something, and, and that's it. He just makes me relax. He gives me everything I need uh, to push myself. The dancing is very different from act one to two to three. I just love the simplicity of the act one. And then you go into proper ballerina mode in act two, is the tutu, the sparkles, the tiara. You really do become the princess. <laughs> Those moments before the performance are always, you know, very precious. That's when the transformation happens. Getting that hair and makeup done. Then being in my dressing room quiet, getting my shoes on. And then it's the costumes. So you start putting all the layers. All those things help you to become the character, to live the story. It's a big part of the performance. It's like you live in Nella behind and you become, in this case, Cinderella. Mm -hmm.